Bray Wyatt is the universal champion? What's good with y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. Um, I wanted to drop this one real quick. I literally just finished recording the other video, so you'll probably see that one, the one where Brock uh, defeats Cain Velasquez. You'll probably see that one first before you see this one. And in that video, I said, I'm pretty sure WWE is going to mess this up and have Bray end up losing anyway. I don't think any major titles are going to change. Boy, was I wrong i literally just watched the match kind of skimmed through it there were some cool spots i don't like the red setting because it's a lot of dark spots so when they're moving outside the ring there's a lot of places that are dark so i couldn't see a lot of the stuff but it was okay for what it was of course the crowd was chanting this was awesome because they don't really see that type of show too often in that country so of course seeing that was awesome for them but for me it was like okay you know, I've seen better matches, better falls count anywhere matches, but this, this was, this was a situation where I'm expecting the worst. I'm expecting them to book this in the worst way possible. The Fiend is going to eat 20 stomps. He's going to get thrown through a flaming table. He's going to get electrocuted. He's going to fall off the Empire State Building. He's, he's going to get shot. He's going to go through all this extreme punishment. And then finally lose to like something mundane. That's what I was expecting. I was expecting him to get destroyed by Seth Rollins at some point in the match and then lose by some some bull bullshit technicality they were I was feeling I was thinking they were gonna find a way to have Seth Rollins win this match and no they gave Seth Rollins the L here and Bray Wyatt is your universal champion I am completely shocked I'm, I'm not making this up. I had to. I didn't even want to try to set up to get the footage so I could watch it with you guys. This is this is my kind of my first impressions, like on the spot kind of emotions right now. Wow. I don't know why they couldn't have done this ahead of time, or maybe even wait to have this match with Seth Rollins. But wow, he's your Universal Champion. And the way he won it, he literally took everything Seth Rollins had to give him, and he was still the champ. So we may end up getting Bray Wyatt versus Brock Lesnar, The Fiend versus The Beast in the champion versus champion match for a Survivor Series. Holy, holy shit. And even then, I have The Fiend win. At this point, you have to book him like this until there's somebody like a noticeable face that's coming up in the ranks. I don't know who to ultimately take him down. I, he needs to hold the strap. Damn near the rest of this year, all the way to WrestleMania, bro. I'm be honest with you. I don't. There's no point in putting the strap on him if you're gonna have him lose it. I'm happy that Bray got the Universal Championship. He deserves it. A lot of people may say it's too soon, but they book themselves in this situation, so they have to book it accordingly. He is still relatively one of the hottest things in the company, and now he's your universal champ, man. I actually am looking forward to seeing what happens on Monday Night Raw, because technically he got drafted to SmackDown, but he can't be on SmackDown because he has the Raw Championship, so... He's going to probably end up being on Raw. I'm guessing. I don't know how this is going to go. We'll see what's going to happen with that. But yeah, man. The Fiend, he got the dub. I'm completely shocked. I, I really don't know what to say, man. Comment down below if you guys are excited with The Fiend finally being a Universal Champion. Like, And where do you guys... Like, who's his next feud? Who do y'all think he should feud with? You know what I'm saying? And where do they take this? How long y'all think his championship reign is going to be? I, I hope it lasts till some, uh, to WrestleMania. I really do. I don't even know what to say. 
I, I, I really was not expecting that match to go that way. I'm completely shocked right now. Uh, yeah, man. All right. WWE, they actually did some smart booking here. Like, okay. I don't, I don't, I don't really know what else to say after that. Uh, just, hey, man. <laughs> I don't know what to fucking say. The nigga actually won the match, bro. He legit won. Holy, what? I appreciate y'all kicking it with me, man. <laughs> I'll see y'all on the next video. <laughs> This nigga break won the fucking match.